I was getting mental training um, in certain aspects. Now, I didn't handle failure well at all, so I was I sucked at that piece of it, and that's probably the the reason we have mental training is that was probably my biggest downfall was I just could not handle adversity. So I wasn't getting that piece as, as much as a, I probably should have as a kid. But the, the piece that my grandfather instilled in me was um, he would literally get upset at me if I even acknowledged talent on the other team. If I even saw, said a kid was big, he immediately would go, he's not better than you. What do you, and he didn't always use the best language either. He was a, an old army guy. Um, but he, you know, he would immediately stop me and, and just like almost not angrily, but very intensely say, Hey, you're the best person here. He's not better than you. You're going to dominate. Like he would never let me think that I was anything less than the best person on that field. And if I even started to say it, he would he would immediately snap me out of that. And um, that's mental training, folks. That's, um, that's the believe in me part of mental training, believe in yourself part, where he just would not allow me to be intimidated or to have any fear at all when I was playing baseball. Um, to the point where I, as I got older and started to realize this, I just, even if I thought someone was good on the other team, I just kept it to myself. I didn't even say anything because I'm like, I know what he's going to say. I'm not even going to say it. 